Brayhead Clan 2, Sheffield Steelers 4 was the result of the first leg of the semi-final here at Brayhead Arena. Joining me is the Steelers assistant coach, did you say? Oh, <laughs> Ashley Tate. Ashley, thanks for joining us. Let's get your name right this time. 4-2 uh, <clears throat> getting into the second leg, that's a big boost for you guys. Yeah, I think um, you know we we uh, we wanted to go home with the lead. Um, you know it was tight. We were two down. We got back in the game, and I think we would have taken three two, and we got a late one, which kind of gives us a bit more cushion. So it's uh, you know it's, it's it's all to play for again next week. You've got the players that can turn it around tonight. Drew Fata scored. Uh, Leguig at the fourth one as well. Tyler Michelle, who won man of the match as well, it just shows the quality you guys have got in there. Yeah, I think uh, we have decent depth. I mean, we're missing uh, Gerson tonight. I mean, hopefully he'll be back for the weekend. But um, you know, Lee has just stepped up and played played really well tonight. And uh, you know, we we got the job done, which is uh, what we came to do. Now, how big an impact is the Challenge Cup having on on your your league season? You're a wee bit behind Nottingham. It's not to say you still you can still do it, but the Challenge Cup it gives you that nice wee distraction, doesn't it? Yeah, a little bit. I mean, um, obviously, as the, the the way the league is now, the Challenge Cup just became a little bit more important kind of thing. I mean, um, you know, we kind of need favours elsewhere in the league, and you know, we just keep plugging away and take care of the next game, get two points, and, and you know, just see what happens. You got that big one in Dundee on Saturday, uh, sorry, Sunday rather. You've come up to, to Scotland again tonight and got another big win. Yeah. Do you find, how do you find it, the, the, the travelling up to Scotland, when you've got to do that journey and then go on the ice and put in a shift for 60 minutes, how uh, tiring is that? Tonight wasn't too bad, I mean, Sunday was a little bit worse, it was our third, third we were in Nottingham Friday, Belfast mm. Saturday, then we went straight to Dundee, so that was, uh, it was a little bit tiring, you kind of you kind of go into autopilot and you, you simplify your game a little bit and you kind of, you know, you just do the little things and, and hope that gets you through and, and like you say, Sunday we got two points, it wasn't, uh, wasn't pretty by any means, but um, you know, we'll take the win and, and, and you know, we kind of used what we did Sunday to, to come to tonight. Now when you're playing two leg defairs, you've got the home leg and the away leg obviously, do you look at the home leg as more difficult, uh, sorry, the away leg more difficult than possibly the home leg and can you say that this is the difficult one out of the way? Uh, no, I don't think so, I mean, Brad have got enough quality to, to kind of uh, go into any rink and, and pick up points, we just have to uh, go around with the mindset, you know, 0-0 zero, zero and, and uh, you know, 60 minutes and we take care of... Uh, take care of business we, you know, we can't go into it thinking we've got two goal cushion because that's where you come unstuck so we'll be uh it'll be business as usual come next tuesday night well come next tuesday the, the message to brayhead will probably be to go at you guys early is it just a case of defending seeing out that first five ten minutes and then taking it from there yeah i mean obviously the onus is on them they need goals they got to kind of uh, throw the kitchen sink out as, as it were um you know it's up to us to kind of uh, make sure we 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 go out and we uh, we dictate the play and we dictate what happens and then kind of take any um, you know take any momentum out that they may build up. What kind of motivation is the fact that Panthers await you in the final? Should you get by Brayhead in the semi final? Um, I don't think it really makes any difference. Obviously, Sheffield United is probably the biggest rivalry in the league, and um, you know it'll be any time those two clubs come together, it's always an event. But um, you know it's it's one of the major one of the three trophies, and regardless of who. Who plays in the final? You know, you, you go in with the same mindset to win. Good stuff. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Thanks, George.